In this video, I will show you how to leverage the power of data merge inside the Best Spinner. Data merge is the ability to create fields in a document that automatically populate from a comma delimited file. This file references the paths to various types of information taken from a file called the data file. Let's say you're promoting a chain of stores with locations in 100 cities. The basic article you'd write is going to be the same for each store. But certain information, such as the city name and the store's specific address and phone number, would obviously vary. That's when using the Best Spinner's Data Merge feature would be extremely helpful. Suppose that each store has the following unique information. City name, store address, store phone number, and store opening hours. We have a plain text comma delimited file with that information already, which looks something like this. We see that the first line is reserved for information headings, and that each data entry's order matches the headings. Make sure the file is saved with the CSV extension. A data merge file may have hundreds of entries, but for our example, we are keeping it to three. Switching back to the best spinner, we see that our article contains what's called placeholders that correspond to each piece of store information. The placeholders are field headings from our data file surrounded by square brackets. When our article is data merged with the data file, the best spinner will produce an article for each line or entry in our data file. We only have three records, so only three articles will be created. Click on Load Data from File and navigate to where you stored your data file. Click Open to load the file. After the data has been loaded, verify that it matches your assigned headings. Click on Merge Data with Article. We're prompted with the Generate Spun Articles dialog box. We cannot choose the number of articles as this is determined by how many entries we have in our data merge file. Next, we choose the file name prefix, whether we put all articles into one text file, and whether to use the nth synonym for each spin block function. To learn more about these settings, please refer to the Generating Articles video in this series. The last step is to enter a file name and click on Save. Opening a couple of our generated articles, we can see that our first data merged article contains our data file's first entry and our second data merged article contains second data entry. Data merge becomes extremely powerful when dealing with hundreds or even thousands of entries, each with their own unique data. The article customization possibilities are only limited by your imagination.